Hello guys, welcome to another tutorial from Xenotrust. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you one new trick. Okay, so um, first off, I need to come to this product and click on edit. Alright, now I'm going to show you how to hide the RMA options. Okay, so this guy here, RMA options from your product page, okay? Just in case you really do not want your vendors to have access to all of these settings, I'll show you how to hide this one. In the previous tutorial, I show you how I showed you how to hide the others options. Okay, uh, so now let's see how we can hide these RMA um, options. Okay, so um, what you need to do is you need to go to your control panel for your website. Okay, um, here is um, if you use a C panel, then fine. But whatever server you use just locate your wordpress installation file it should look something like this okay wp admin um, content and includes okay now go into your wp content folder and then into your plugin folder okay now if you use dokkan pro um, then you should have the rma options so i'll go into dokkan pro and i will go to assets no i'll go to templates and then I will locate. Let's see. Let's see. Okay, I think I'm in the wrong folder. I'm going to go back and I'll go into modules. Okay, so I'll go. I went into Dokkan Pro and then I went into the modules folder. And then within the modules folder, there is this RMA folder. Okay. Okay, now within the RMA folder, there is now the templates folder. And then within that template folder, we now have the RMA folder. Okay, another RMA folder. So this is the folder we are interested in. Okay, so basically what I'm going to do is I'm just going to copy this RMA folder. All right, click and I'll copy it. So you should do the same. Find a way to copy this folder and paste it in your child theme. So I'll go to WP content and go to theme and then child theme and then Within the child theme, I created a Dokkan folder, so I'm just going to paste it here, so paste. So this is the RMA folder right here, right? Now, I'll go to my um, code editor because I'm using a local server on my computer, so all the WordPress files are on my computer. So I'll go to my code editor and mix and edit this particular folder. So I'll just do this and... Okay. What I can simply do is I can just open this up, the RMA folder, and I'll click on products. So I'll open up this products folder in my code editor. Okay, so this is the folder right here. So basically what I'm going to do now is I'm going to add one um, right angle bracket, left angle bracket, an exclamation mark, and two hyphens. So basically what this does is that it comments out this body of code. If I go ahead and save these um, changes I made, and you may ask why I'm not closing the comments, that's because there is already a closing comment at the end of the code, I think. Okay. So I really do not want to look for where the closing comment is, but once you add in this um, opening comment code, you should be able to disable that feature. So now let's go back to our page and RMA options, right? Just after attributes options, and then I'll refresh the page and so we can see what is happening. Okay. So as you can see, there is no RMA options anymore on the page. So attributes RMA options is gone. So that's how you disable or you hide the RMA options from your Dukan plugin customization all right thank you so much for watching this tutorial if you're not subscribed to my channel please go ahead and subscribe um see you in another one